Welcome to Desk Geek. Today I'm going to show you how to get the best resolution out of your two or three screen setup. So you can see I have purchased two of these ultra wide beautiful LG 2560 by 1080 monitors. I was replacing two 1920 by 1080s. I hooked up the first one and noticed that it only had an HDMI connection on the back, no DVI. Thankfully, I had a DVI to HDMI adapter, and I thought, well, I'll just plug that in, and we should be good to go. But, lo and behold, when I plugged in my first monitor, got gorgeous 2560 by 1080 I plugged the HDMI into the adapter and into one of my DVI ports, and I've got 1920 by 1080 which looks horrid on a uh, ultra-wide monitor. You can see here, now I have both monitors at 2560 by 1080 and I'm going to show you the trick of how I did that. You've got to purchase a device, though. There is no magic that I can give you that's going to uh, do this without having to make a purchase. And it's not cheap, but it does work beautiful. And you can use it to add a third monitor to your setup as well. So it's well worth the price of entry in my mind. So what we have here is a pluggable. That's the brand. And what I'm showing you here is actually the HDMI to... Uh, uh, DVI connector that I tried using at first which didn't work you'll see on the forum some people recommend that uh, but didn't work at all here we have the pluggable dual head graphics gigabit ethernet adapter it connects into USB 2.0 or 3.0 I'd recommend using it on 3.0 just because you're gonna get better transfer speeds you get DVI support HDMI support VGA and even it adds an extra ethernet port for all the trouble of having to add this adapter to your computer, which is kind of cool. Uh, you're going to need dual core, 2 gigahertz or better CPU, Windows 10, 8.1, 7 or XP. Uh, you're going to need available USB port, obviously, and at least 30 megabytes of disk space. Because once you plug this in, it's not going to recognize it right away and turn on. You've got to, you've got to get the software going. So I'm showing you the HDMI, the DVI. You can plug two monitors into this at once, but just keep in mind if you put two monitors on this, it's going to lower the resolution down slightly. So you're not going to get the full, for instance, you have three widescreens, you're not going to get the full 2560 by 1080 out of all three if you have three plugged in. But since I only have one, I was able to get that. This device was fantastic. It was easy to use. It's lightweight. It comes with a uh, DVI to VGA adapter. I really think you can't go wrong with this. Go check it out. Let me know what you think. I look forward to hearing about your comments. If you've had success using a different method, I will talk to you later.